Hey, Assalamualaikum. It's me again. So I'm back with another candle video. Today I'm gonna be telling y'all about uh, Bath and Body Works candles that I purchased during Candle Day. I'm not gonna show y'all all the candles that I have, but I'm just gonna show like a couple little ones that I burned. Probably about four of them. So the first one I want to show y'all is Winterberry Wreath. Winterberry Wreath has fresh picked orange, juicy blackberry, and warm vetiver. This candle smells amazing. It matches me. <laughs> it smells amazing. And the throw to this candle is a, I would say about an 8 out of 10. It's not very strong. You see a white wax. It burns clean, no sooting, and it smells amazing. I usually don't go for citrusy um, candles or anything that have a citrus scent note to it. So this was definitely something that I tried. Um, actually, they did have this around Candle Day. Yes, yeah, so this was a, a Christmas time candle. But I'm happy I did try it because the blackberry expresses more than the citrus that's in this candle and i love blackberry which i'm going to talk to you guys about the next candle that i purchased because this one made me love blackberries and this was also an experiment or you know something i just wanted to try blackberry cream frosting this is one of the illuminary candles from bath and body works so you know when this lights up you can see the designs like it's it's a pretty candle you will see the design once the candle light up so this candle has fresh blackberries sweet vanilla and bubbly prosecco it smells amazing as you can see this candle burns pretty clean it's no sooting white wax um one thing i noticed about these candles that came out during war well, some of the candles that i've gotten for the uh, candle day is that they burn pretty fast these candles burn pretty fast i already burnt one of these already so that's how i can tell you that these burn fast and it has no sooting i burnt this one like two times so but the one that i have it yeah it burnt pretty quick burnt the mess out that joint and my sons they love this candle they smelled a hint of uh lemon they asked and lemon isn't a part of a scent note in it but it's a very sweet candle and i love it it's i think i told you guys to throw it's more of like, that one i could say is about a 10 out of 10. that one is a room filler it's a it's a um it definitely is a, it's a high throw to it i lit one of those in my living room and it filled up my entire living space down here and it's again like i told you guys i have a very open it's a lot of room down here so it filled up my living room yeah so the next candle i want to show you guys is midnight snow pretty candle so midnight snow has juniper berry cedar wood and soft lavender this is another fast burner it's also a soft masculine scent as you can see this candle is sooty it sooted a lot it, it sooted and this was a white wax i have one burning right now so the throw to this is not a very high throw i would say it's a medium to light throw i would say it's more of like a six seven out of ten i'll give it a seven out of ten it smells amazing so would i buy this again i would if i didn't already have six others <laughs> so this is also an awesome um choice but like i said it burns pretty fast so the last one i want to show you guys is peppermint marshmallow peppermint marshmallow has crushed peppermint fluffy marshmallows and powdered sugar this is a very sweet it's not very sweet it's it's a lightly sweet candle it's not over peppermint like so strong that it uh, give you a headache but you know peppermint is like uh you know some of the candles like the twisted peppermint one i'm like 
you smell that joint on cold it's like oh my god like i think i don't even want to like this it's so strong but this candle it's it's a very a very beautiful candle it's red wax it burns pretty fast what you see in there is not soot i had broke off the it does mushroom it's some it mushrooms uh the wicks mushrooms so you see me trying to probably you can break it off and scrape it in there but anyways this burns so fast and hot it burns so hot like after about two hours out you know touching it the entire glass the entire candle was so hot that i'm like whoa this joint i burnt this i think like three times honestly but it, it, it definitely isn't bad would i buy this again i would i would buy another one i have another one already and if i wanted to make this a room filler i would burn two this is definitely not a room filler i would say that you could burn this in your bathroom it'll fill your bathroom up it'll fill your bedroom up like it's it definitely will fill small spaces up but when i burnt this in my living room it does not even my dining room it does not fill up my dining room and again i told y'all is i have this is some room it's, it's much bigger than a couple of bedrooms so would i put this in a massive space absolutely not so this is a light thrower i would say that the throw is i would say this candle ent entirely is light an eight out of ten it's all right i love the scent of it it's not overly strong i would i would give it a nine i would give it a nine out of ten because i would buy this again so it's it's not really it's not that bad it's just it burns fast and really hot and that was just like i think these candles is like the first i've experienced that where it burns super hot and i'm like dang this candle gonna be gone and like you know it'll be gone i think let me see the blackberry cream frosting i burnt i think i burnt that up in like three days like maybe four i'm gonna get no i burnt that in four days it burnt it down like it was it was good yeah it, it just burnt so fast and i'm like that was crazy but anyways thank you guys for watching my videos and i hope that you enjoy some of the candles because of course i have a bunch more that i can show you guys and tell you a lot more about but i hope that you have a good rest of your day and assalamualaikum peace